Let's delve into what will hopefully be a couple of uh, winners for Boxing Day Tuesday at uh, Sha Tin. And uh, Paul, you're keen on uh, one that's trolled very well down the straight. Yeah, look, seven of these horses in this race have uh, first starters, but this one isn't. Uh, Baby Crystal, we know what we're going to get with him, and gee, I just really like the way he he trolled here. Francis Loy has, has got him. He started off life with uh, John Size, but I think Francis got him going really well. He put blinkers on for the first time. You can see the blinkers really sharpened him up here, and he ran away uh, and won this trial really easy. Horse that runs seconds running on the card as a first starter, but uh, called Kaima, he's higher, he's rated higher, but a really nice uh, trial from Baby Crystal. And I think he can win a race for uh, Baby Crystal. Now with uh, Francis Lloyd, number one. Yep, the horse that was fourth in that trial fund together has been racing very well. Mm -hmm. So there's a form reference there also. Uh, first starter for me, which comes up in race number five. And it's uh, called uh, Top Scorer. And uh, he's trained uh, by John Sy, Zach Purton Rhines, a shooting to win uh, three-year-old. Now he's had a handful of trials here. Zach Purton's been on board for the last uh, three. Last trial was a little bit awkward and slow out, but this trial uh, here, he was half a stride slow, but was up on the pace and uh, looked to uh, move well. Was just beaten by module construction there over the final uh, stages. So we're hoping for a good run from him. There's a few other first starters in that race as well, but race five at number eight, uh, top scorer. And uh, Paul Keener on uh, Baby Crystal, one of the horses going around a little earlier in the card on Tuesday at Charton.